Bermuda is an archipelago of 138 islands that are covered in pink, sandy beaches. Specialty shopping, world-class cuisine, and beautiful golf courses. You might be eager to visit, but just take into account these 10 things not to do in Bermuda before going. No before you go! 1. Don't try to rent a car. If you're hoping you'll be able to rent a car to zip around one of the islands, you'll be out of luck. Bermudan law makes it illegal to operate a car without a Bermudan driver's license. 2. Don't rent a motorbike. If it's your first time on one of these scooters, you might want to think it twice. Many local bus and taxi operators tend to exceed the speed limits on the roads, and they often switch lanes without any warning. 3. Don't forget to try a swizzle. This tasty concoction is made with Gosling's Black Seal Rum, Gosling's Gold Rum, pineapple juice, orange juice, granadine, and Angostura bitters. A swizzle is then spun rapidly between your hands and inside the cocktail to give it a thick mm. layer of frost. 4. Don't visit the pink sand beaches. One of the most talked about attractions in Bermuda is the pink sand beaches. If you want to enjoy some peace and quiet on a less hectic coastline, check out the quiet beach on Warwick Long Bay located on Bermuda's south shore instead. 5. Don't visit on a tight budget. You really shouldn't expect to receive a discount on anything in Bermuda, since everything has to be imported in. It's all marked up to insanely high prices. 6. Don't touch the Portuguese man of war. It's known to float above the surface of the water. Below their purple bladders, they have polyps which contain long tentacles ranging from 30 to 150 feet long. They can inject venom and in some cases it can be fatal. 7. Don't stop by the Royal Navy Dockyard. Adjacent to the cruise port, this area is full of expensive restaurants and pricey shops. However, if you travel just a few miles more, you'll find more shops and restaurants that have decent prices. 8. Don't book a budget hotel. Many people advise visitors to stay at a bed and breakfast instead. The accommodations will be much cheaper, and if you're traveling with a large group, a B&B &B will be less expensive per person. 9. Don't stay off the beaten path. The islands are so spread out that it's difficult to make your way from one end to the other. Far from the central locations, many buses stop infrequently, and a lot of the routes end around 7pm every night. After that, there would only be expensive taxis. 10. Don't be afraid of sharks. There's really no need to fear them. The two most common, Galapagos and Dusky Sharks, don't come very close to the shore, and they're relatively harmless. Bermuda is known for having a low amount of shark attacks. Where do you want to know what not to do in next? Comment below.